Hey YouTube, we're back, and I hope this is the last round of our epic mailbox on ripping, unwrapping, untaping. Oh man, it's a lot of stuff. Getting right into it though. Keep going, keep going. This is a 1990 score, or no score, not score, classic. Ken Griffey Jr. Remember getting this set when I was 10 years old that Christmas? And I always wanted to get this card back on the PC. That's cool because I don't have my childhood cards anymore. So that's cool. Right back at it. Here we go. This is a live stream. Ronald Acuna Jr. Pink Parallel. Awesome. Next up. Oh, that's cool. That's an old. Ryan Sandberg. Top send away glossy all star. 1985. You used to have to send away. You could get those little sets every year in the 80s. Let's see what we got here. Oh, this is going to be a tough one. Maybe not. Thank you, please come back. Thank you, please come back. see a Paul Molitor rookie card from 1978 in here with Alan Trammell. It is great for the vintage Hall of Fame rookies. Rookie on there, Paul Molitor and Alan Trammell rookies. 78 looks like it's pretty good. A little soft corner there. Love it. Keep the train a rolling. All right, what could this be? You never know, because I can't get this paper open. It's taped very well. Cubs. It's another Rhino. It's the 35th anniversary of the 86 design. I think this is from 2021 or 2020. Pretty cool. 2021, I think that was just last year they did those. Mike Piazza, Flair Alto rookie from 93. Hall of Famer rookie. Oh man, I'm doing all these videos in the same day. A lot of uploads today, but I want to get this done. A little Gary Sheffield rookie. A little cheapy. Gary Sheffield was an awesome baseball player. Looks like there's two of them. 89 Flair Sheffield and 89 score. Rookie. That guy had an amazing career. Next up. Next up, we got Hubie Brooks and Mookie Wilson, 1981 Tops Rookie for the Rookie PC. Pretty cool. Hey, 
<sighs> no, we got this one. Just rips real easy. Chris Bryant. Also got this back when he was still a cub. No longer a cubby. He's been hurt all year. He's in Colorado, he hasn't been playing. It's kind of a lost year for him this year. What else we got? Oh, that's a nice rhino. Green, statistically speaking. Panini product, I think, from last year. Hmm. Next up. Keep going, keep going. It's a marathon here today. Determined to get this box done and uh, might actually do it. Oh, yeah, this is one of my favorite cards back in the day. 89 Bowman. Ken Griffey Jr. and Ken Griffey Sr. Father and son from the 89 Bowman set. It's a really awesome card. Keep it going, keep it going. There's like five left, guys. Holy guacamole. Getting to the end. What is this? The tattoos action. Bought this before the PEDs, which he says was an accident. He said he had a ringworm. So, and he has passed all his other tests up to this one, and he wasn't actually playing, putting up, so he wasn't putting up fake numbers. Hoping that in his age, I'm hoping he gets, gets a little smarter with his decision making. Stays healthy, maybe bounces back in these cards. Will be worth having. Or he can end up like Manny Ramirez cards where he has a heck of a career but nobody cares. I do. I I, I think I give I think he's he's gonna be alright. I think if he does it again or has a bunch of more injuries <clears throat> then I'll, then I might lose a little more faith, but I don't know. I kind of believe the ringworm story. I know it sounds silly, but you can make that mistake, I guess. Oh, wow. 74 Lou Brock. Great shape. Soft little corner at the bottom there. Let's see if I can straighten that out a little bit. Nice. Love me some Lou Brock, some vintage. Vintage 74. The sun's coming out. Right. Alright, we're getting it done. We're getting it done. Even if we gotta go a couple extra minutes, we'll do it. We'll do it. Envelope inside of an envelope. <clears throat> the card not in the top order. Fred <laughs> McGrath. That's totally random. I love this finest set. Anytime I can, I find the finest All Stars from the '93 set. I pick them up. This was iconic set back in the day. So I always pick up. All stars and Hall of Famers from that set. If I see them cheap, definitely don't remember getting that one. But that was a nice surprise. What we got here Ernie Banks. That's nice. Silver pack. Ernie. Twenty eighteen. Keep on that trash in the bag here. Got the hiccups. All right, look at this little neon green here.
another Griffey. Lots of Griffies today. That's $94. That's the parallel. The foil parallel. Griffies. Got a lot of Griffies. Next up. That's a nice one. That's from this year. The artist palette, Sandberg. Very nice car. Oh my god, I see the end here, guys. I see the end. One, two, there's three left. And we did it. Sitting here for years trying to get through this. Couple years now. A Joe Adele rookie. The 86 from last year. Refractor. Hope he pans out. He's got some, definitely got some talent. Next up, ooh, it's a slab. This is, this is Barry Bonds on it. Looks like the 87. Jeez. Why would you stick it right on there? It's gonna be sticky stuff. 87 travel update, Barry Bonds rookie. Got the Larkin in the other one. It's a nice little slab. I've never heard of this company, but I love this card. I think I, I, think I remember that was like seven bucks or something. Good deal. Usually I see that card goes for like 20 raw. See, I think Tatis would be like Bonds. I still have fans. I never know that Bonds in the Hall of Fame, but you can't deny him. He was one of the best. What is this one? Oh, a little set here. It's a set. Donner's 89 traded set. I used to love these little sets back in the day. Just try and ask for them for Christmas. They're usually affordable. Still sealed. A little unusual puzzle. There's a checklist. I wonder if Griffey's in here. I think Griffey is in here. Randy Johnson. That's awesome. Freshly sealed Donruss from 89. Dig it. Nice little surprise. Don't even remember picking that up. And, guys, we did it. Last but not least. What could it be? The grand finale. The grand finale. Oh, another little set. The cola collection. All Star Game set. <clears throat> Excuse me, July thirteenth, nineteen ninety three. This box is kind of rough. Hope the cards are in better shape than the box. Let's see what we got in here. We got Alomar. 
Barry Bonds, Ken Griffey Jr. Nice Griffey. Oh, all the corners are messed up. Look at all those corners are all bad. That sucks. Crook, Puckett, Dalton, Boggs, Williams, Ripken. Nice Sandberg. Yeah, every corner. Rodriguez, Van Slyke, Olerud, Glavin. All damaged. So that's a bummer for the finale. It was a nice set. I'll still throw it in a book. I have a book with just little mini sets. Oddball sets. All the KBs and stuff like that. Toys R Us sets. Try to be careful not to make those any worse than they are. Alright, and we're right around just passing the 15 minute mark too. Perfect. So that's going to conclude our series. As you can see. Cards we've already opened and no more mail in the box. So we did it. That's excellent. I feel accomplished today. Anybody who is checking this out, I hope you I hope you dug it. All the oddball stuff. Pretty random. Pretty random stuff. Hope you dug it. Stay tuned. We got more stuff coming up. Movies, toys, cards, pretty much anything else. That I feel like doing and going through my hobby adventure. I like to document on the channel here. Alright everybody. This is going to be the last one for the day. It's a long one today. Hope everybody stays well. Doing well. Doing good. Peace.